just like that. All right, here we go. Time for another solo over Night in the Woods. This video right here is going to be a continuation from last week's video. If you haven't seen that video, here's the thumbnail. Check it out. It was titled something to the effect of Solo Over Night Building a Ultralight Bushcraft Loadout or Kit for 25 pounds or less. Um, we went over each piece of gear, explained what I'm carrying, why I'm carrying it. And when we were done, we came out with a good base weight of 25 pounds. So again, if you haven't seen it, check it out. Now that brings us to this week's video. We want to utilize those kit items and do some type of bushcraft overnight build. Okay, something basic to show you that you can cut trees down, you can get logs, you can make a bed, you can meet all your needs and do it for 25 pounds or less. The two main things that will always add to your base weight are gonna be some type of food for one, two, three, four, five days, whatever you decide to carry, and the comfort you want with your sleep system. And as we mentioned last week, if you can't carry 25 pounds, you're not gonna all of a sudden carry 45 or 50, okay? So keep that in mind. Now we chose this spot right here because it's a rocky overhang. And we got coverage on three sides, over here, above, over there, and behind us as well, okay? So it's three sides and a ceiling. Okay, so technically four sides. So any wind comes up, we're blocked. Any mosquitoes that want to form around here, we'll have a fire going. The smoke's going to vent up and out. The fire's going to radiate up and around this way as well as this way and keep you nice and warm. And to be brutally honest, I'm going to cowboy camp in the woods because we have this overhang. The main thing I got to figure out is a bed to get off the ground. So on that note, let's get her done. So there's the sunlight I was talking about. There's not a cloud in the sky. So once it pops through, it just whitewashes everything out. All the lens adjustments don't work. I tried lens covers and all kinds of things throughout the years. What works the best is overcast skies. So this is what I'm thinking. We're off the ground, we're out of the mud. Right here, put the fire pit. Where I got half a pit right there with the rocks. And there's rocks right here. So it's just a matter of grabbing some rocks to fill in the spot right around here, contain all the coals. 
Smoke's gonna vent out. Give me light that will bounce off the walls here. Keep all the mosquitoes away. Got a nice spot over here, toss my gear. I can actually sit on that bench right there. I can sit right here. Or this could be a spot for firewood. Just roll over, toss some logs inside there and call it home for the night. So first week of May, you can see how hot it actually is or humid. I'm in the shade and sweat through my shirt and my pants and my undies. All right, so real quick here before I forget, and start working on that fire pit over there. Midweek videos are back. They've been back for a while. Most continue to miss. You're not being notified, I realize that. But here's how you get around that. You simply go to my channel and check. Um, if you can't do that, then you're gonna miss the videos. Um, there's nothing else I can do at this point. Um, we started a fishing series last week, and the goal is to drop one video a week during that fishing series, and then move on to a different series. Now here's my take on these series videos. I like taking a step back and do something that's polar opposites. I'm doing skills with action, and then we're gonna do an overnighter, you know? So that way it gives you two different takes on something. Um, and it seems to be working out a lot better for me, um, but you know, to each their own. Um, if you wanna spin your wheels and pump out convoluted, confusing crap, you know, be my guest. Those that have been waiting, the Camp Companion from Hardcore Hammers is now back in stock. That link is inside my video description box. We have a video on this showing to just demolish trees. And also, you can throw it like a tomahawk, it will stick into a tree. There's people online that are now sending me and the company videos that they're just blowing through trees, just chopping massive amounts of firewood, and the thing is still razor sharp. Um, this thing is just ungodly sharp. So if you haven't gotten one yet and you've been waiting, they're back in stock. Go to my video description box, click on Hardcore Hammers, and get her done.
just like that. Had to work for that one, tell you what. Well, I bet most of the problem is humidity. This stuff's all damp, sticky, but we got her done. Breath of life, baby. So that fire pit right there that we built earlier is doing exactly what it's supposed to do. It's holding all the coals right there. That heat is pumping off of me. Remember we talked several months ago about the theory that heat just goes straight up. Well, it doesn't because if that was the case, sitting in your front room, you wouldn't feel the heat from your fireplace 12 feet away. We're a good probably six foot from the edge. So about four and a half feet right here. And that heat's just killing me right now. It's going up as well bouncing off the walls here and around me you see some small amount of smoke over here no mosquitoes so that's always a good sign it's actually actively raining out there and i'm tucked back under that rocky overhang so it's doing exactly what's supposed to do happy with this once again some type of natural shelter like this fall upon something like this it's a godsend and to be honest if you had to hunker down you don't even need a bed like this you can sit right here on this rock and stay warm and dry. So once again, mother nature provided. And the best part is we utilized our 25 pound gear loadout kit from our previous video and did a bush craft the overnighter. So tomorrow we have my modern skill survival course with Buckeye Bushcraft. So we're gonna forego dinner tonight. We'll have dinner in the morning. Because once I'm done with that, we got to DD out of here and pick up students. So, on that note, I'm going to load this bad boy up, and I'll catch you all in the morning. So the smoke is doing exactly what it's supposed to do. It's creating a funnel, like a vortex, tornado type thing. It's going right out that way, taking everything with it. So last night, no mosquitoes, but it was so humid because of this rain. Honestly, that fire did nothing for me as far as helping me sleep. It actually probably made it worse. Um, is what it is. And this is an odd change. Dinner for breakfast. Can't go wrong with raviolis. Catch you all in a few. Uh. Uh. So real quick here, my Etsy store has been open for a long time. Um, guess what? Right now, Go to my video description box, click on my Etsy page, and we have 50 Corporal's Corner cup and bottle sets that just dropped. And we're going to land 50 a week for the next four or five weeks. So those have been waiting for one, now's your chance. 50 cup and bottle sets just dropped. Along with that, we have 50 Corporal's Corner drive hooks that just dropped as well. So. Check those out. Once again, that link is inside my video description box. Pretty much last thing on the agenda before I get out of here and go pick up students is uh, I have an event May 17th through the 19th, 2024. That's only a couple weeks notice, but we'll be in Dallas, Texas at the convention center for the NRA gun show. I'll be there with hardcore hammers. And yes, right now on the website, which is also located in my video description box, um, we have the Camp Companion, the Corporal's Corner Camp Companion X is now available online. It's also gonna be available at the NRA Gun Show in Dallas, Texas at the Convention Center. Once again, it's May 17th to the 19th, 2024. And I believe we're in booth 7447. So stop by, say hi, get a picture and grab an ax. So, other than that, 
There's one more announcement. I was going to try and keep this quiet, but in about two weeks, there's going to be a major development, major announcement, commercials, if you will, on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, online in general, and it's something I'm going to be a part of. I was asked to be a part of it for several reasons, and um, once I saw what they were going to do and saw what was happening, I jumped on it. And that'll be known here in about the next couple weeks, one to two weeks, somewhere in there. And you'll know it when you see it. On that note, let's go ahead and end this bad boy off. With that, all the gear in my videos can be found on two places. One, my Amazon affiliate page, and two, my Etsy store. Both links are found inside my description box. Now, please do me that favor. Hit that like and subscribe button, then ring that notification bell. Once you ring that bell, please select all notifications. And as always, thank you for your comments, views, and support. Thanks for watching. Get out in the field, have some fun. I'm going to catch you next time.